Hello friends! What you are seeing is right. This is the barest of Coach TJ's. No makeup. Well, maybe just a little lipstick. Otherwise, I will look so pale. Ang putla ko naman on camera. And yes, I am in bed. Why? Because our topic today is La Dolce Far Niente. The sweetness of doing nothing. That's what the Italians say. And I actually realized they're correct. You see, during this quarantine period, I got to watch again the movie Eat, Pray, Love. It's a must watch. It's an old film, but it actually tells you to stop and take a rest. And I guess appreciate life. And I really believe this. You know, the Americans, the way they define their lives is to work themselves to death and pack everything in a two-week vacation. Their savings, their, it's a gra el grande vacation. But the whole 300-something days, they're working themselves to death. That, unfortunately, has trickled down to me. I mean, my earliest days of uh, corporate life has been trained by you know, Americans. So, that got instilled in me. And so, I have the same problem. I always feel I have to be doing something. If you were my staff before, I would tell you, oh, wala kang ginagawa. If your left hand is doing something, your right hand must be doing something as well. And at the end of the day, I would ask everybody, how was your day? Do you think your day was productive? Guess what? As a mom, I also do that with my kids. But now I realize that this quarantine period has given us the opportunity to really step back and rest. And there are times, and I'm sure a lot of you feel this, this way, yung wala ka nang ginagawa, you're so bored, and you're like, oh my gosh, I'm not doing anything, I'm so lazy, tamad na tayo. Relax, people. Apparently, our brains need to do nothing every day for at least 10 minutes. And I'm not just making this up. It's actually based on a formative paper done by a neurologist, Marcus Reichley. And he said that the brain, when at rest, is actually in what you call DMN, Default Mode Network. The brain, remember the brain has a lot of wires, right? Connect the dots. Goes to a default mode. The brain apparently at DMN starts to think about the person it is embedded in. It processes emotions, it recalls memories, and it thinks about the future on its own. It actually has a wide spectrum from dreaming to depression, but I don't want to go there. Don't let yourself go into that state. So let's look at the positive side, the positive effect of putting our brains at rest. Remember why we need six, seven, eight hours of sleep? That is because our brains are at rest and the brain is not actually resting it's starting to tell all the functions all the systems in our body to work to reset like livers reset kidneys reset blood start circulating heart you know kaya pala we need that time to sleep so sleeping and getting enough hours of sleep is very important because the brain is at rest now can you do DMN within the day? Yes, you can. In fact, the experts are saying 10 minutes a day, you just have to sit still or lie down or take a nap. Kaya pala the Italians and the Europeans, they have, they really close their shops after lunch and they take a nap. Siesta. I remember my mother when I was young, she would always tell me, take a nap, take a nap. 
Because apparently, it's good for us. Totoo pala, it's really good for us to take a nap. Not, I'm not telling you to sleep the whole day. Ha? I'm just telling you to take a nap. In fact, in the offices, diba, we call it a power nap. Because it's important to refresh, reset our brains. Let us do nothing. That's why I call this the art of doing nothing. What does doing nothing mean? It means that, number one, no screens. And when I say screens, it means TV, uh, computer screens, and cell phone screens. So none of those if you're doing nothing. Also, no music. Yes, no music. Why? Because anything that will stimulate cognition makes our brains work harder. So not even music. So it's literally closing your eyes against all distractions. Some people, they can sit down in the garden or take a walk. That's fine if that's what you want to do. But we can't obviously go outside right now. You can't even read the book, ha? Ke horror sa akin. Because I love to read. But 10 minutes lang naman. 10 minutes, make it a daily habit to unload your brain. And it will refresh you. And I guarantee you, it will even give you the solutions to the problems you have been so desperate in seeking solutions or answers for. Okay, this doing nothing is actually part of taking care of yourself. Self-care, self-love, okay? Next week, I'm going to talk about, it's a full video of, you know, self-care hacks. And I'm going to bust some myths too. But I wanted to really focus on doing nothing for one video for this week. And I want you to practice it for the whole week. And if you can share what happens, if you feel refreshed, if you feel it really worked, then please like and, and comment on this video. I would really, really love to share ideas with you. So, this is the time now that I have to take my 10 minutes and do nothing. So, I'm just going to fluff all the pillows here. Ah, I like this one for my neck. Okay? And I'm going to lay back and do nothing.